Welcome athletes, parents, families, school committee members, guests, and alumni. Thank you for joining us on this special evening's dual meet between Mahar Senators and our Frontier Red Hawks. Before we start tonight's meet, we'd like to take a moment for some important recognitions and to honor the seniors of both teams in this season's final home event here at Frontier Regional School. We are so very pleased to be here on our newly renovated track. Thank you to the Frontier community and the towns of Conway, Deerfield, Sunderland, and Waitley for your support to complete this project and continued support of our schools. The school committee would like to take this moment to recognize two very special people in our track and field program. These two teachers, coaches, and mentors have been coaching track and field together for 32 years and share a combined 75 years of coaching for Frontier Regional School. Walt Flynn has been coaching boys track and field for 32 years here, beginning in 1990 and cross country in 1995. <laughs> Under his leadership, the boys have won three league championships, have had 23 individual Western Mass champions and two individual state champions. Away from the field, Walt taught English at Frontier Middle School for 28 years, mentoring hundreds of students along the way. Walt's colleague and friend, Bob Smith, has led the Frontier Girls track and field and cross country teams since 1978. For the past 43 years, Bob has coached track and field for a record of 262 wins and 16 losses. He's coached 30 individual Western Mass champions and six individual state champions with an impressive nine Western Mass titles. Bob Smith was also inducted into the Massachusetts State Track Coaches Hall of Fame in 2014. Like Walt, Bob taught English at Frontier Middle School for 37 years and has also mentored hundreds of students. At this time, assistant coaches Megan Dredge from the class of 97 and Andrew Flutter from the class of 2011 will join Walt and Bob. These two coaches, both Frontier alumni and track stars in their own right, will present a plaque to each honoree this evening. The plaques read as follows. The coach Bob Smith and Walt Flynn track, in recognition of your commitment, dedication, hard work, and countless hours of service to the students of Frontier Regional School, as teacher, coach, and mentor, we honor you by dedicating this track in your names. Stone with a brass plate commemorating this dedication will be installed here within the coming months. Thank you, Walt and Bob, for your commitment to our school community in creating a program that has positively impacted hundreds of students for decades. Frontier officially welcomes you all in attendance tonight to the Coach Bob Smith and Walt Flynn track. take this time to honor the seniors of each team on this special night. We'll start first with the boys team. First, we'd like to welcome Dwight Balk. Dwight has been a great leader this year and has been on the track team for as long and longer than I have. He's a great inspiration and a, and a strong leader of the team, helping to keep our team focused and committed all year this year. We'd like to thank Dwight for being on our team. Thank you. I'd like to acknowledge Ben Lazat. Ben has been a, an exemplary leader, mentor, and athlete. He's been an amazing teammate and a continuous positive influence on all the boys' track team. We're incredibly grateful to have Ben on our team. I'd like to 
recognize Jack Basilio. Uh, we all know Jack's really talented at track, and I think we all, I personally, and a lot of others on the team look up to him, and all he does, all his hard work, the dedication to the sport, it's an inspiration to all of us. So, thank you, Jack. to honor our senior girls. I would like to recognize Isabel Marapizzi. Izzy, you bring so much positive, positive energy to the team and are truly the definition of a captain. You help uplift and motivate others and are always there to listen to any minor inconveniences. You are a true leader and your values will be missed on the team. Good luck in college and live your best life. Lily Markey. Uh, she is probably the kindest, funniest, and most wonderful person I know. When I started running the mile in freshman year, I immediately felt such a welcoming and encouraging vibe from her. She has now been my running buddy for three years and one of my best friends for one, and I can honestly say I couldn't have gone through track without her. After every run, no matter how long or fast, she stays with me and tells me to keep going or that I killed it. And I think I can speak for the whole team when I say we are incredibly lucky to, ha to have her as a part of this track and have such an amazing friend. I know that whatever she does, it'll be amazing. I love you, Lily. I'd like to recognize Sierra Young. Sierra has made this track season the best experience. I am lucky enough to become friends with her over this season. She is funny, kind, and supportive. As a captain, she pushes the team to be the best athletes they can. I'm grateful for everything she has done for me. I owe her a tremendous amount, including gas money. <laughs> I'd like to recognize Elena. Elena has always been a great teammate to look up to on this team because of how much she shows her love for this sport. The amount of energy she brings to practice each day makes it more enjoyable for everyone, and her willingness to try new things and help others is what makes her such a great part of this team. I'd like to recognize Emma Russo. Emma has been a part of this team for a long time and is acting as our team manager and one of our scorers this year. Emma is such a funny, kind, and caring person that I'm so grateful to have gotten to know this season. From her organization at the scorer's table to her fantastic jokes and stylish sunglasses, Emma adds such a positive layer to this team. I know we're all glad to have her here with us, making us smile and bringing us carrot sticks at each and every meet. Emma, I love you so much, and I know you're gonna yeah, go far in life. I'm so excited to see what you achieve, and I'm so grateful to call you my friend. Ever since joining the cross country team my freshman year, I've found that Sadie Ross is someone who I can constantly look up to and admire. The spirit that she brings to the team is unmatched, and never once have I walked away from a conversation with her without a smile on my face. I know without a doubt that I can talk to her about anything, and somehow she seems to have an answer for everything. I'll try to keep this short, but Sadie, I wish you the absolute best in the years to come, and I know that you'll continue to do great things after you graduate. You'll be missed by all of us, especially me, and I'm forever grateful to have you as both my teammate and as my friend. Uh, I'd like to recognize Caitlin Mackin. Unfortunately, she couldn't make it to our meet today, but she has worked very hard for this team, and I want to recognize her. Caitlin puts in 100% and 10% into all of her workouts and is always willing to try new things and step up when she is needed. I've played sports with Caitlin throughout the years, and she always makes them so much more enjoyable. I know she'll be missed very much by our whole team. I'd like to recognize Maeve Hewitt. Although she can't make it today, Maeve is one of the kindest and smiliest, smiliest people I know. I remember not too long ago, it was pouring rain, and there was mud everywhere. It was horrible. Yet there was Maeve with a smile on her face, throwing a jab, cracking jokes left and right. This is just one of many instances of Maeve's incredible spirit. Looking back at Maeve's season, it is amazing to see the progress that she has made in both the mile and javelin. 
She puts so much into everything that she does and still makes it look effortless. It has been amazing to have her as a teammate as well as a friend, and I know she has made a lasting impression on everyone. I just know she will do great things in life and touch so many people. seniors on the Mahar team. We have Caroline Chase, Ava Liberty, Sienna Moore, Grace Rich, Taylor Susie, and Caden Spencer. And the seniors on the boys team is Max Gilmore. I'm zooming. this evening. Let's enjoy the meet. Yeah, I'm gonna get a picture of you out there. 